After a long break from education due to the pandemic, students are now attending school in person. Getting back into the routine of school, however, requires some precautions to be taken by teachers for students who have type 1 diabetes. So with the start of the school year, it's important for teachers uh, to know certain things about type 1 diabetes. Um, children with type 1 diabetes in school may need to eat outside of designated meal times and they also should be offered unrestricted access to use the restroom. According to pediatric dietitian Reem Al Matruk, teachers should have some awareness about type 1 diabetes, which can ultimately have a positive impact on the health of students who have diabetes. Okay, so, in terms of low blood sugar, uh, this may look like when the child gets dizzy, shaky, uh, hungry and uh, starts to sweat. Uh, in this case, when the teacher sees this, uh, they should stop and tell the child to check their blood sugar. If it's below 4 millimoles, that means they have to consume a fast-acting carbohydrate, which means something like juice or a tablespoon of honey, not chocolate because chocolate has a fat content and it's going to slow the absorption of sugar in the body which is something we don't want when we're trying to raise the blood sugar quickly. Further shedding light on an important matter regarding students who have type 1 diabetes, Al Matruk went on to explain that it is important for teachers to know that students who have type 1 diabetes shouldn't be treated too differently from other students. An insightful and informative interview about the well-being of students living with type 1 diabetes. From Dasman Diabetes Institute, I'm Gemma Taburi, reporting to you for the English News.